Good morning, guys. After a very hectic morning, we are on our way to this little boy's appointment for genetic testing. Uh, it was it's, we we're pretty we're pretty hectic. We're pretty messy. <laughs> we're already five minutes late. We as in me because I had all morning to be ready, and I choose the hour before. Right, guys? Because I lost the keys. No, he didn't. They were in my pocket. I was on. Okay. I, we were on time until I, I misplaced the keys. I thought they were hanging. Then Haiti said he was using them, but That's he wasn't. What I saw. He wasn't because I left them in the pocket of my jacket. So it's on me. But we got full house here. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully there's no um there's no frustration. I'll let you guys I'll let you guys know how it went. You are okay. We are all done. Oh. That's it. It was just your weight, your height. And your head. The head was hard. And some selfies. You're good. You're good. Now they're going to come and talk to me. All right, buddy? All right. So we tried to check out your heart. We tried your ears. You let her do the eyes. And that's as far as we got, huh, Christian? Now we're in a different room playing with toys. That's all right. I figured. Oops. Sorry, Papa. Look at how big you look in that chair. Look at how big. And you're looking at the office, huh? And we are back in the car. All right, that took about 45 minutes. I talked to the doctor and she kind of broke down my family history, which is very, very simple because it's, you know, I have the kids with the same dad, Hugo. I have no medical conditions, neither does Hugo. Um, my family doesn't have any kids, so there's not like a big tree, honestly. Um, she has some ideas. She's gonna, uh, I think she gave me the, the thing right here. Hold on, before I forget, while it's fresh, let me talk to you guys. We are doing the microarray, which I think is the most common one, and the fragile X again. Um, I thought it'd be best to just get that. Obviously she asked for it, so she wants it. I don't, I don't wanna go and search for the results or whatever. Um, so how it works is she, is going to ask for the those tests through quest quest is going to ask for an authorization through my insurance and once my insurance does the prior off and they like approve it and all that which can take about three weeks they are going to take the blood out and it could take a month for for the results and once we have the results she'll talk to me about what the, the results what the findings are if there's any and go from there with like treatment and diagnosis and all this other stuff so we'll get more of an idea i saw a bunch of comments saying you should get a test you should get a test and it was already in my mind when um i mentioned his pain um, hopefully we get some answers as to what's happening she did say she thinks there's two things and i already forgot what she said but it's pretty much because you guys know christian is so big um there's something called like something in regards to him being so big and obviously his bones are gonna hurt and this other thing but she said she doesn't want to go too much into detail because i mentioned that he has gro growing pains or pain and that's why I'm, I'm seeking out this test and if this might help and she said yes she has a theory but she doesn't want to go too much into it until she gets the results so that's where we stand right now christian did good he did not he just didn't want to be touched he hates being touched every time that we do um any kind of like doctor visits i always tell myself like don't force them they don't need it and then i, I find myself being like hands down hands down trying to hold his hands and then i feel bad but they didn't get to do much and that's okay christian overall overall you did amazing papa chomping away on the book i see put it down papa christian you know that doesn't go in your mouth. Christian, thank you. <laughs> Ready?
good morning guys i'm home for a little bit i have a couple things to do but i wanted to end the video here for you guys um regarding the genetic testing i don't know if i mentioned that the main reason why i wanted to do it was uh, to kind of see if i can get an idea on if there is anything you need to pee luna okay come on so pretty much anything that will give me an idea on how I can better improve his um, therapies or his medical treatment and care, um, I would love to know that, whether it's comorbidities. So pretty much that's it, honestly. I'm focusing so much on his pain and what is triggering the pain uh, that I, I just kind of want to know. It's it's always also recommended to get genetic testing. A lot of people don't get it because of the price. I was one of those as well when I initially got told to get genetic testing when he was diagnosed at age two and a half. Um, I didn't do it because it was not covered by insurance, which happens a lot. Um, but this time I called my insurance and it, it, there, there's a chance for them to approve it. And I just think it's really important at this stage um, with, with regarding to his pain and his care. I want to know if there's anything else that I can be doing. So yeah, right now uh, we are not doing testing. Just Christian, if it's needed later on, we can all do testing. I'm hoping that insurance does end up covering everything. And with that in mind, um, it'll let us know if, you know, we will also be moving forward with testing for ourselves because if it's super expensive then I can't do it all of course so thank you guys for watching this video I hope to have some information soon I did get one letter back I guess my actual pediatrician requested the fragile x testing and I guess uh, this other testing so they approved that so I'm hopeful that they'll approve um, this one as well in a timely manner because my doctor requested it um, like the 20 first and it was approved on like the 31st so it was like within a week so hopefully it doesn't take too long to get these approvals so we can get that blood work for Christian so thanks for watching guys I'll see you in the next one bye